For this video, we're going to talk about number 52, Jack Collins, offensive tackle, defensive end, and punter for Pleasantville High School, located right here on the screen. This kid is a very productive two-way player. He's listed at 6'3". He's a long, lean athlete. You can tell there's a lot of room to put muscle mass on, which I like. And for the first part of this video, we're going to focus on the offensive end. This kid has very good feet, okay? So it helps him pull block, helps him down block, gets out of his stance very quickly. But once he gets his hands locked into you, you know, he can drive people. And, again, blocking the defenders at the second level is very important. And this kid has the feet to do that. He can block linebackers. He can block DBs. On the defensive side, the kid's an explosive edge defender. He uses his hands very well. You can see him. He, does a, he has a really nice rip move. Um, and he's productive in both the run and pass game. And you'll see that at the second part of our video. But let's start with the offense. Okay, I mentioned he's located right here at the tackle spot. And what they're going to do is you're going to get a crash, you know, down block by this tight end. He's going to pull around and block this linebacker. Okay, watch how, watch nice footwork. Look at him cock back and watch him deliver the blow right here. Boom. Look at him explode. He just drives the linebacker right out of the picture frame. All right, one more time. Watch his quick feet. Look at the nice pull. He keep, uses his eyes, okay? He's looking for the guy he's trying to block and delivers a big shot right there. Let's go to another play. All right? Again, good feet. You're going to see a down block. He's got a quick edge guy in front of him. Guy's going to try to shoot the gap. All right? You're going to see him down block. Okay? Once he gets his hands locked in, he can drive people. You're going to see that. Watch him. Again, nice quick step. Look at him drive and just pancake him. One more time. And watch him get out of his stance. Nice quick step. Cuts him off. And look at him drive him and finish him off. You know what? Let's do one more time. Again. This kid's got a lot of room to grow to, which is really impressive. Let's move now to the defensive side of the ball. And I think this kid might even be a better defensive player than an offensive player. And it's because he has a really good, he does a really good job of using his hands. I, I mentioned the rip technique earlier um, in the video. It's quick, it's powerful, and it, and it works for him. He also has the versatility to move inside in pass rushing situations. But he plays the run really, really well. He has good enough feet and good enough speed to stop sweep plays. So even though at 6'3", he's long, you know, he's not slow. He's not you know, he, he doesn't run awkwardly. He's a smooth athlete. So let's go over a couple of plays. He's at the edge right now. And he's going to be rushing the passer on this first one from the edge position, okay? Simple enough, but watch the rip move, okay? Look at how quick the rip is. You see how him rip that arm, back arm through, okay? He smacks the offensive lineman's hands off of him. Okay, that's good stuff. You want to see young linemen use their hands. He does a really good job. And you see this often in his tape. Okay, let's go to one more play. This is him at the defensive tackle spot. Okay, so now he's going to be rushing the passer from the inside over the guard. Okay, you're going to see he win with a rip. Now he's going to win with strength. Okay, he's going to lower his pad level. He's going to extend his arms and drive the guard into the quarterback. They look at him, drive him. Then once he gets to the level of the quarterback, then he's going to use his hands to get off. Okay, watch it one more time. You watch him right here. Okay, you're going to see him drive the guard and then get off. It's a great job. Kid's an impressive player.